The original 9.3 mile Spa-Francorchamps circuit was designed as a large triangle around local country roads and held its first race in 1922. With long, straight and fast flowing corners, it was a daunting challenge from its very beginning. In 1946, the circuit was modified, which made it even quicker. You're still able to drive on some sections of the old track, and even in a road car, the master kink still provides a feeling of the bravery required to go flat out through the Ardennes forest, usually in the wet. The circuit quickly became known as one of the most exhilarating, but also one of the most dangerous. And in 1969, the F1 drivers boycotted the race after multiple fatalities. They demanded safety improvements, and when the circuit failed to meet requirements, it was dropped from the calendar. Formula One returned to Spa-Francorchamps in 1983 on an all-new but shorter track layout. And although the circuit characteristics had changed, it was still a tremendous challenge and remains a driver's favourite to this day. Probably the most famous corner in Formula One is the awe-inspiring Eau Rouge. Extinct turn one at La Source, coming downhill into the valley, the drivers flick left before going full throttle to the right-hander and the 115-foot elevation change uphill into Radium. It's almost impossible to give an impression of what the drivers have to go through, but from this angle, you get some idea of a driver's eye view of the wall of asphalt that these guys face every single day.